right, ladies, you heard me. Post pictures like his mom is gonna see your profile. So, this is one of my random videos. I just happened to be thinking, and I was thinking about how my boy showed me this picture uh, from Plenty of Fish that this girl had on her profile. And it just made me think, man. Like, some girls, they post pictures, you know, showing, you know, like really showing their ass, um, titties hiked up in a push up bra, cleavage down to here. Um, and then in their profile, it says, I'm looking for a man that'll show me that chivalry isn't dead and to treat me like a true princess. And excuse me? <laughs> there was this one girl when I was on Plenty of Fish last year sometime, and I saw her profile and I thought she looked good. So I went to her profile and I was looking through her pictures. And she had a picture of where she was taking a picture in her car, but her legs were spread and you had to see the way it was intentional. She wasn't just driving. I know, ladies, your legs can't be together when you're I, I understand. She was sitting in her car. From the angle, you know she wasn't literally driving, okay? You had to see it. I was like, I saw another picture. Where, and I wrote her on that. I wrote her. I said, now you know you were wrong for that last pic. <laughs> Oh, she never wrote me back. She did come to check out my profile, though. Um, there was another girl I saw where she was sitting, like, with her legs open. And it was, she could see her. I was like, what the fuck are these girls doing? So, the reason why I say post pictures like his mom is going to see your profile is because literally men will put you into two categories when we are on something like Plenty of Fish or, you know, uh, Match.com, whatever it is. Actually, we put you into two categories in real life when we see you, okay? What'll happen is if a man is looking for a good woman, literally, if he's looking for a good woman, he'll see your profile and Heels, like, you know, they'll see your profile, but like, oh, man, she's gorgeous. So we'll go to your page. Um, we'll see what the rest of your pictures look like. That's what guys always do. We see what the rest of your pictures will look like. You see if you've got full body shots. See if you're not hiding nothing. You know, if you're a big girl, you only got head shots. Then we know, you know, it's just we look for certain things. We look for certain things like pictures with your tongue out, uh, pictures showing too much ass, shoot too much titties. Um, you being too fucking wild. We look at this stuff. Okay. So after we see your pictures, then we read your profile, but let's get back to the pictures here. When we read, when we look at your pictures, your pictures tell us whether or not we can bring you home to mom or not. And if a guy is in a, I guess you could say in a frisky dating nature to where he will He's basically gonna do this. He may contact you, and it may seem all good to you, but you will only get fucked if you have fuck pictures up, if you have whore pictures up, if you have wild woman pictures up, if you have risque pictures up. That's it for the most part with men, okay? We automatically put you in that, that area. But then there's the girl where we get to her page and everything's classy. Everything's classy. You know, she's pretty. She takes care of herself. We see the nice clothes that she wears. She's out with her friends. You know, it's, you know, you know, pictures of girls take high. Yeah. <laughs> you know, shit like that. It's not like, uh, you know, the ass all out. Of, uh, you know, it's, it's not like that. So we automatically put you in marriage material possibility woman okay so then that guy that is dating you you are getting the real deal right there you are getting a man who was looking for a woman to marry or to be with long term okay you put up them whole pictures it, now look I do realize there are some guys 
many guys that are just dogs. It don't matter. You can have classy pictures up. You can have hoe pictures up, okay? But I'm not talking about those guys because you usually find out who they are pretty quickly. I'm talking about I'm trying to protect you women right now so that you can stack most of the positive cards in your corner put up classy pictures as if his mom were going to see them because guess what when we're thinking about the good girl in marriage we'd like to be able to show her pictures of you think about that for a second if you can show all her pitch profile pictures to your mom what does that say about that girl now if you like uh, I don't want to see that one okay this one see and she's pretty, and she's mom. So tell his mama, yeah, you like her, I like her. You know what I mean? It's, no, it's it's not going to, you know. So um, that's why I did the video, because I've seen so many women that they're half, they're half whoring in their pictures. And and when I, when I you know, when I was on Playing Fish, I was saying, I'm going like, you almost had a good man coming after you, but now I got to get rid of you. Because I even saw one girl, she wrote on her profile, and she, she was bad too. She heaved up titties, and she said something like, I'm this, I'm that, you know, I'm a good girl, but I love attention. Oh, really? You didn't really have to tell me that, because your titties are hanging out almost to the fucking nipple. So... You women like that? I got a buddy that is constantly, he's a serial dater, and he is always knocking down chicks. Always. And he showed me some pictures, and they are, for the most part, these women. They are, for the most part, these women. He showed me one picture of one chick, and she was pretty, and she was classy. And he actually got into a relationship for her with a little bit. But he's a serial dater, so he ended up uh, leaving her anyway, as usual. But um, I can tell when he sends me pictures of the new girl he's messing with, I know what he's going to do. Point blank. So um, I hope this helps you, ladies. Okay. I am saying this because I'm trying to help you, not hinder you. Okay. If you like this video, press the like button right now. Yeah. One million subscribers. Woo!